Y escuchen esta historia que les voy a contar, o mejor, imaginen. Imaginen que ustedes van un día hacia su casa con su papá que ha conducido durante muchos años y de un momento a otro a él se le olvida el camino, el recorrido que debe hacer para llegar a casa. En ese momento, la hija que va al lado se da cuenta de que algo está pasando con su papá. Este es tan solo un fragmento de la historia de Para, dada Paul que sufre Alzheimer y su nieta en Madagascar. Es la historia que llevó la fotógrafa Lee Ann al WordPress Photo en la categoría Historias y con la que ganaría. La serie se llama Balín Bavena y este es un concepto malgache que se refiere al deber de los hijos adultos de cuidar a sus padres. También nos habla del amor, del desconocimiento de las enfermedades mentales, en especial el Alzheimer. Con ella hablamos y esto fue lo que nos dijo de su serie ganadora en el WordPress Photo. Hi, I'm Lian Ovachen, I'm a visual storyteller from South Africa. Valimba Bena is a Malagasy principle that means we are because of our parents. It's the idea that we as children owe gratitude to our parents for everything that they've done for us in life. The story of Valimba Bena tells the story of Farah and Dada Paul and his granddaughter. Essentially, at its core, it tells the story of a family dealing with dementia and how Dada Paul is cared for by his daughter. It's a simple story about family, about love, about grief, about memory loss and what that looks like in Madagascar. Due to a lack of public awareness, there's still a lot of misinformation about dementia and many families don't even know that the disease exists. This results in a lot of stigma and in Dada Paul's case, nine out of his ten children have ostracized him and it's only Pharaoh who has stood by him and who care for him. The story of Valimba Bena is a very simple, tender, intimate look at a family dealing with memory loss, with grief, and looking at that from a very intimate perspective, it, it becomes a very universal story of, of family, of loss, and I think it's something that most people can relate to. Most of us know somebody who's living with dementia, and it's such an incredible privilege to be given access to this family's life, the way they shared their, their home and their family life with me. Um, and I think for me, it's an incredible honor to be recognized by World Press Photo, not only because of what the award means to me as a storyteller, but also knowing that the story that I care about deeply will be shown to a global audience and that more people can learn about Farah and Dada Paul and more people can have a greater understanding of how dementia affects families in different parts of the world and what different communities may need in order to be supported in caring for the elderly and understanding dementia as a brain disease.